Religious freedom needs to make room not just for private beliefs or perhaps for secluded worship behind closed doors and high walls, but for distinctive public action based on countercultural commitments. And this is why the test of religious freedom in many ways is how it protects, protects minority religious communities. Religious freedom should protect you if you're a Jew in Saudi Arabia, if you're a Palestinian Arab in Israel, if you're a Christian in Malaysia, or if you're a Muslim in Nashville. The test is how it protects religious minorities. Because being denied religious freedom, being uh, prevented from acting out your deepest commitments in public is one of the deepest denials of human flourishing. 